Hey guys, Austin Prince 56 here. Um, this is like my third attempt in recording a video to show you guys how to make cubes in Microsoft Paint so I can actually post something that I actually know about. But um, this is sort of a me testing out my mic because I've been having a lot of problems with it. As you see, I have uh, Realtek HD Audio Manager open and I've been having to fool around with the microphone boost but um I don't know and my recording volume is just like way low but if I if I use the mic boost it just messes everything up and it's hard for calls because I can't people can't hear me at all <clears throat> so I'm going to try and save up to get another mic um, hopefully but um so this is my website I have it, it's pretty much done the link is gonna be in the description but there it is right there um, it's awesome friends 56 productions except for uh, a w e s i m e because I screwed up whenever I did that and then um, the copyright down at the bottom is messed up so those are a little bit of it's a little bit of something that you you should know right there but um we're not going to spend mu much time on there let's close that out so I don't go back to it um I'm sure you hear my bird in the background but um we're going to make a cube quickly in Microsoft Paint because I don't feel like doing another 15 minute recording on this so you start off with just a regular box okay and you're going then you're going to sort of eyeball this and make a, another box once you do that you're going to get the line tool and you're going to connect to connect all of the corners and we're just gonna zoom in right here real quick so I can do such thing don't be don't be afraid to have something sticking out you can erase that later like that I'm just gonna go ahead and undo that because that was just way off okay so once you're done with that, you're gonna you're gonna get the eraser tool. I'm gonna get that a little bit bigger. If you screw something up, there is always the undo button, or you can control Z it like I do from time to time. But um, yeah. Once you get all that erased, um, sorry, commentary is a little off. Like I said, I'm just I'm doing this to get a video up, and I need to remember to stay in the same spot, or it's just gonna sound weird in the video, and I'm not gonna be able to edit the audio correctly and all that junk. So, um, now you have a cube in its current state. You're gonna select the cube, and I'm gonna I'm just gonna move it down to the bottom because that's where I need it. And I'm gonna copy it and paste it. Now you won't be able to get it to line up in the first try, but this is just something that I'm quickly doing. It seems like I was able to get it to line up pretty well. Um, and you could just sort of make. 3D images in paint with this little trick. So, um, like you can't do that. That's the only problem. But, um, seems like I was able to get it in the first try. Um, and yeah.
it's it's cool to do effects with it like you can after afterwards you can sort of just get the darker blue and shade but um yeah Moss and friends 56 uh i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please thumbs up if you liked it if you didn't like it thumbs it down i don't care all opinions help and I can sort of tell every time I breathe into the mic, it just sort of goes all the way up. Um, and I'm going to try and fix that sometime in the near future. Um, like I said, I'm going to save up and get a new mic. But um, yeah, if this video helped you at all, please favorite it. Um, if you'd like to, you can subscribe. Whichever, whatever you do, it helps me. So, my name is Austin Friends 56, and I wish you all a good evening.